everybody and I'm here with the live and we'll see if anybody gets here I just got back from Target I wanted corned beef so that I would have it for next Tuesday and while I was there I found this amazing book so it is a sticker book and I'm gonna do a page-by-page -page walkthrough of this and we'll check it out. I am so excited and we're going to make at least an embellishment or maybe more um, using this book. We don't have a lot of time today, but we will be doing that. So happy Friday the 13th. Um, I hope you are all well. Hi, Lynn. So has anybody seen this book out there? Um, it's pretty cool, pretty cool. So $24.99, and of course at Target you get 30% off, so that made it 17 something. I have a red card, so I got another 5% off, and this week on Cartwheel, if you used your red card, you got another 5%, so I got the book for like $15. And um, so, Oh my gosh, what the heck? I just had, hold on. My computer is doing its own thing here. <laughs> there we go, okay. So who do we have here? Say hi. Hi Terry. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and take a look at this book. And again, it's the antiquarian sticker book it is a whole bunch of stickers some of them are quite strange but they are really really cool hi RV into Disney hi Linda hi create creative oh Shanda hi Shanda hi Mitzi hi Mary okay so one of the things the first thing I noticed when I opened it is I have bought a couple of really old books from uh, Selena at Amour Fabriques. I, I love to get books and things from her when she has her little, um, her live uh, sales. And they have had this on the inside. So this is an antique image that they've put on the inside of this, this book. And I just think it's really cool. So hi, Bonnie. Hi, Mary. Welcome. So, um, you guys, I, I, I just told them I went to, I went to town to get, um, corned beef. So I would have it for Tuesday and I went to Target and I found this book. And so we're going to go through it really quick page by page and hopefully we'll have time to make an embellishment or two. So look at these great images, an artichoke. I love it. A variety of coral butterflies. Okay, that's really strange, but I know there's people out there that love that kind of thing. But that's probably what my brain looks like on the inside. <laughs> so, um, hands. Look at the hands. And an egg. So, really cool things. Really, really cool. So, now in between your sticker pages, you have pages like this. And I'm like going, oh my gosh, this is an altered book waiting to happen once it is, um, all the stickers have been used. So look at these fairies. You have fairies, then you have the clown ladies. Some cherries. You've got butterflies all over. Look at the guy. The guy's dancing with the candlesticks. Hi, Melissa. And so flowers and again the pages in between the pages and you've got dice and fish so let me know what you think are the really cool ones I love these pansies oh yeah it would be an it would be a pretty envelope look at these botanicals yeah so you could after you have your do your stickers you could have a whole bunch of envelopes too Look at the sunflowers. So um, I did put the entire 
Dear Julie Julie digital kit at in the Etsy shop. All of them are on sale um, for 50% off. So there's a, there's two sunflower kits in there. If that's something that you're thinking about doing, you might want to go ahead and check those out. The antique roses are on sale. Laura's roses, 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 all on sale for half price. That's the digital kits. Look at this, the maypole. Oh my gosh, I have, I have, I, I think I have enough stuff to do almost a maypole, like a mini kit. So, kit on a dog, look at that butterfly. So again, these are stickers, um, and you know what, that looks like something I could use in the journal that I'm working on. So somebody asked if they peel and stick. So there we go, we have it peeled, and we have this started. So let's go ahead and we'll just put that right on there. Um, I have this little, while I was waiting for things, the, the thing to upload yesterday, I, I started making a little mini book. So this was some of that Garden Inn note paper that I had from the hotel, and so I'm going to turn this into a little notebook but look at there we just boom we've added this beautiful sticker and then look the there's you can see the paper behind it so some more hands mushrooms all kinds of funky shell things coral I guess maybe and you've got a couple of universe things there's a kid coming out of an egg a tomato that would be cool in a um, in a fairy kit in a, in a fairy kit in a fairy journal so yeah so what we're looking at is we're looking at the antiquarian sticker book I picked just picked this up at Target for it's got over a thousand stickers in it and it's always it's 30% off so the cover price is $24.99 so it was like $17 something I used my red card so that got me 5% off and this week on cartwheel you got an extra 5% off if you use your um, red card so I actually got 10% off the 17 so like 15 something is what I paid look at the pansies and another butterfly look at some strawberries and a poppy and look at that's kind of cool they're hanging on <laughs> some more hands yeah if you have the red card and you have a target close I would go get it today because you know it's like that extra 5% <laughs> well for me <laughs> of course it's it, I went because I, I needed corned beef for Tuesday because I, I want to make sure look at that so that sticker is it's cut all the way around it and um, you know you could you could go ahead and distress right in here and then pull your sticker off if you wanted to the paper is really nice so you know what let's go ahead and check that out let's see how it would do if we distressed something in here I have I have green yeah it it just it holds the distress really well it's not shiny you guys I'm telling you so um we've already looked at at least 15 pages okay so if you went to Dollar Tree and you bought stickers You'd buy one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. So you would have already paid for your book if you bought Dollar Tree stickers right there. 
okay and you'd still have all the rest of this so I'm just trying to show you what the value is here you guys there might not have been a notification my thing wouldn't even let me look, go back and look at my clock so there might not have been a notification today I came home from the store I put the groceries that go into the refrigerator away and I came in here and started this live so um, so again, in between your sticker pages, and you've got some really wild ones, some really wild things, in between you'll have these pages. Okay, so there you get some bugs. William's going to like this. My grandson's going to be an entomologist, and he told his mom the other day he's probably going to be single his whole life because he's going to be an entomologist. <laughs> That's the person that studies bugs. Oh my gosh. So I, I made a video today. It'll go up later today. It's the um, mini challenge in the challenge. And I kept saying penguin instead of peacock. And there's some penguins. Oh, you guys in the mother, the dear mother kit, digital kit, these would go really well, really, really good with it. Because there's a mother playing the piano and the kids are dancing. Hi, everybody. They came in. Hi. So, yeah, and now, and then you've got some of this, this, the weird things. I, I consider them weird, but I know a lot of people really, really, um, you know, like this, this kind of stuff where the people have wings and, and they, well, he's probably just wearing his clothes there. So, but there you go. You got a rat and a. Stingray or some some kind of ray. Look at these. Oh my gosh. So and again, where it comes out at the edge, you can go ahead and distress, and um, because the paper is not yes yeah, steampunk. That's the word. Thank you guys. No problem, Terry. I'm glad I was able to do it. That's all it said. I, that's as far as, as late as I can deliver it according to Etsy. But we might be able to change it if you need it further. And that's just so that, you know, that it doesn't keep saying on my thing that I'm, I'm late. So look at these beautiful images. Look at these. Look at these fish. So, for all different kinds of kind of paper crafting, um, you know, there's all the different kinds of things that you might be wanting to... Oh, look at her. Okay, so now we're way past if you invested at Dollar Tree in stickers. We're way past paying for the book if you got it at Target. Because Target, you get 30% off your books. Oh, look at, he stuck his thumb in the pie. <laughs> oh my gosh. They're catching bats. <laughs> There's a harp. There's just so much to see in here. I, oh, oh my gosh. I love that. I might have to do a whole entire journal on that because of that picture. Oh, look at these. It's cool. You want me to go in that hat? <laughs> you want me to climb in there? I don't think so. You'll make me disappear. <laughs> and the monkey's got a hat. So again, um, oh yeah, here you go. So this is the Antiquarian Sticker Book. It was $24.99 at um, Target. But of course at Target you get 30% off. So it was $17 something. I bought it today with my red card. So I got my regular 5% off. And Cartwheel or Target Circle or whatever it is now. 
had a special thing that you got an additional 5% if you um, did the special offer. So I did the special offer. So, oh my gosh, look at these. And look at these flowers. I mean, there's just so much in here that... And then in between each page, you have these pages. Okay? So I can just see this book, you know, after you use the stickers, then you could it could be an altered book. It's, like, so cool. <gasps> look at these. So this looks like something Alice in Wonderlandy. She's wearing a rose dress. You got some chickens over here with a tree. I don't know. Has any have any of you ever seen any of these images before? Sometimes it's really fun because I'll go through things like this and I'll have seen that image before. Look at this. Here's a a fairy. Hot air balloon. Oh, a unicorn. Now, that's not something you don't see. Unicorn. I, I haven't seen a lot of unicorn in the antique-looking stuff. But very, if you want to do steampunk, oh, my gosh. Oh, look at the witch. And then look at the folky, folk art stuff. And the pears. Look at these clocks. This is amazing. Oh, thank you. Vonda just looked this up on Amazon, and it's 1667. She said, if you're like me and you don't have a Target close by. Thank you, Vonda. Thank you, thank you. So, um, yeah, for those of us that might be um, staying home, well, I always stay home, but, yeah, this might be, uh, I, I bought it for myself for Easter. That's what I told myself. Okay, my mom's not here this year to do my Easter basket. So I might use some of this before the Easter. <laughs> before Easter. But it will be in my Easter basket. Look, some more penguins. We call them panga ducks. My sister's, my sister. Look at these. Speaking of Easter, look at here we are on Easter. And talking about Easter. And there's the Easter bunny. Thank you, Easter bunny. Um. My sister collected penguins, and she called them pangaducks. Oh my gosh, is that Eve? <laughs> she got an apple. Don't eat it. All right, Terry. Oh my gosh, you do? You collect penguins? Well, my sister had, oh my gosh, she had so many, and... <gasps> These are stickers. Oh my gosh. What are, how, okay. How do they, how do they, what are they? There's a butterfly. They're random, you guys. Can't tell. I can see a butterfly cut out here. I guess it's potluck. You'll have to, you'll have to figure it out when you get it. But there is a butterfly down here. I don't know if you can see any, I don't know, but isn't that cool? Oh my God, I love those images. I should do something like that in a digital kit. Just a bunch of flowers like that. What do you think? Let's just do a bunch of flowers digital kit. Yeah, you know, I was actually thinking about <laughs> doing an, an, a thing another channel now I already have content for it um, kids crafts because of the change on YouTube you don't want I don't make videos anymore that are um, geared towards kids but I was thinking you know I have a lot I used to have a daycare an in-home daycare I have a lot of ideas of things that kids can do with stuff that's already around their house and so I was thinking about doing that. So we'll see. Oh my gosh. Are you enjoying this? I hope you're I hope I'm not I'm not uh boring you with 
this. So, um, yeah, a steampunk journal in my future, probably. So again, if you just came on, we're looking at the antiquarian sticker book. I just picked it up at Target. Um, and Vonda just found it on Amazon and Terry found it in the UK, um, available for pre-order. So if you are wanting to get yourself a gift, here you go. That's an interesting page. There's a chicken. There's a Harlequin lady with the mask, some carrots, a hand. He's got his tongue out. I think that's a nest. Oh, it is. It's the nest like they build. It's like a ball and they, they have their nest on the inside. Oh, I like that with the one. So again, the sticker pages are not like shiny. We distressed on it a little bit ago and it holds the distressing ink really, really well. Um, so I think that this is awesome. In between the sticker pages are these um, pages of antique images. Somebody suggested that maybe we would make envelopes out of those. I think it would be awesome to be an altered book. You could go through and like take out a signature and you'd have some pages. And then you could, because to do an altered book, you take out some pages. Then you could also make envelopes like they said. Okay, so these come out in the center and around the outside so you have some frames you have a rainbow trout label I like that and an elephant label yeah I I will probably well I'm not gonna hoard it I, I'm gonna use it I've learned that um, oh that's gorgeous look at that image so I I just I think the value is definitely here. Even if you counted that as $1, the value of this book is definitely here. It's not prime, though. It's not prime on Amazon. They're telling me. Oh, I do think everyone needs a rainbow trout. And oh my gosh, look at this page. You guys, I have a mushroom kit coming out. Is anybody interested in a mushroom kit? So I have a mushroom digital kit. I have 48 digital kits in my shop. 48. I, when I went and did the sale and put the sale together and it said 48, I was like, oh my gosh. So there are 48 digital kits in the Dear Julie Julie Etsy shop. And they are all on sale for 50% off through <clears throat> St. Patrick's Day. The cool thing about those is you can go ahead and download them and use them now as long as you have a printer and can do that. There we go. Look at, we got more bugs and shells and more ladies and more flowers. I mean, there are such a variety of... <laughs> Terry's obsessed with mushrooms. <laughs> All right. Oh, it's still free shipping. Catherine says it's still free shipping on Amazon for Prime members. You just don't get it in a day. <laughs> Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? And look at, ah, look at the kitty. Oh, look at her. So she needs to go in the book that I'm going to make. So it's probably going to be blue and yellow. And it's going to be her and, and, and her. Oh my gosh. So there's going to have to be some kitties. Little Kitty Midnights. Kitty Midnight has been quite mischievous, mischievously just, just lately. Oh, oh, look, 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 look. A peacock. Okay, so I said we would do a... Oh, I wanted... I wanted avocado. Oh no, we're not using avocado dyed paper in that journal anyway. Let's see if one of these will. Nope. Okay, so I'm thinking it's going to have to go. There we go. Okay, so here we go. 
we'll go ahead and make an embellishment. I was hoping that we would find some peacocks in here that we could make an embellishment. I am going to go ahead and use the green distressing. Look at the witch and look at like Red Riding Hood there. And I'm going to go ahead and use the green distressing because I told you I would show you about this. Okay, I'm not buffering, you guys. Um, my, my, um, I, I have a computer on so that I can see what you see and it's not buffering. Okay. So I am distressing across the whole thing. I know, don't, don't panic because Julie is distressing, but I know many of you like to distress and I just wanted you to see that this book, you can distress in this. I think this book would make an amazing gift if you know someone that likes to paper craft or is a card maker and uses this kind of thing. I'm excited because I think that this is going to work really well with a lot of my um, digital kits. Okay, I'm going to do something really strange here. I want to... I want to distress this um, bit. I know you're going to fall over. Okay, Frances said she had to refresh to, refresh to stop the buffering, and when she refreshed, it stops. So you might want to try that, you guys. Okay, so I am going to go ahead. This is one of the papers that I'm using in the Peacock Journals. You hear that? Journals. You guys, I think I'm going to end up with three or four journals trying to use up this um, paper kit that I'm using and my digital kit. So, and if you haven't gotten the Peacock digital kit, it is on sale along with the other ones this weekend. Okay. So I know you guys are freaking, those of you that have been around for a while are going, oh my gosh, Julie distressed two things. Not only did she distress, guess what else this means? It means that Julie is going to have to distress more things in the journal. Okay, so um, there, now I have this and this will be on my page and it gives some color to my page. We might as well go ahead and do this one also so this whole embellishment will be beautiful um, and let's see what I'm, I'm looking at the I'm looking at the peacock and going okay what else can I do because you guys I didn't get to look at this I didn't even know this peacock was in here I know that there's one at the very back of the book a little tiny one but I did not know that this one was in here I'm very excited and um, Check out that tiger on the next page there and some owls. Oh my gosh. I have stuff to do owls. Okay. So there we go. So that, and now I've got these two pages are ready to go into a journal and they are distressed, have a distressed background, which I think is going to be really cool. We'll go ahead and take our peacock it comes off very easily now there are some little curlies there so and we're gonna put it on this page oh you know what if I do this of course it looks like it's standing see it's got its legs it's like it's it's standing and saying, hey, I am, I am it. <laughs> so with that, I think it's going to need some, um, oh, cool. I see lots of people that are going to have this in their future. Oh, this brush is kind of wonky. So I'm using the the gold fingernail polish that I like to use, this is from Dollar Tree. It's the number 544. It has gold glitter in it. You probably want to use it not in this room because um, 
today I can actually smell it. Um, you want to be in a well-ventilated area, just like you would if you were polishing your nail. But you know how a peacock has that beautiful metallic sheen. And so I'm just going to go ahead and add this to it. Um, if your chat stopped, you might also want to go ahead and refresh. Sorry about that, Terry. So our rain finally stopped, but I did wear my rain boots and my rain jacket to the store, which was kind of cool because you guys, I, we had so many years that we didn't have rain that I didn't get to, I bought new rain boots and didn't get to wear them for like four years. Um, but because of the puddles, I went and, and because it still was misty and we have the chance of rain for, um, for days in the valley here. Um, it is the, here we go, the Antiquarian Sticker Book. The Antiquarian Sticker Book and uh, an Illustrated Compendium of Adhesive Ephemera. <laughs> what a great name. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and continue this. Um, I will probably come back and add some more stuff to this because I need to get through this book because I did tell you that we were going to go all the way through it. But I did want you to see that these stickers seem to be working really well. That you can go ahead and distress right on the sticker page. You can see that you have beautiful pages in between that are holding the sticker pages. This um, fingernail polish is changing this bottom color of these. It's actually, I think it's really kind of cool. So there. So I think it might be kind of fun to, to add some more, some more to that, but that's the beginning of an embellishment using this sticker sheet and we'll see how well it stays on there I'm, I'm gonna, gonna put this up here for it to dry and let's move on so you guys have looked at this page for a long time and there's a lot of great things some more hands so these are the pages that are in between the pages Bonnie I, I didn't Yes, Francis, I love to use that fingernail polish. And as a matter of fact, what, what was it? Last last month, I I had to I was out of it. Had to go buy some. Um, another hot air balloon, a fan. We haven't seen a fan, or I haven't seen a fan, except for that one where the lady was, um, or where all those fairies or angels were in the sky. Speaking of angels, birds, more angels, another, another, though this time we have an angel coming out of an egg. Look at these stars have images inside. The eyeballs freak me out. <laughs> Couple more hot air balloons. We've got a lot of steampunk going on in here. And now we have some fall leaves. <laughs> and a random skeleton and a bear. Okay, wow. Look at these, all these ocean creature things. I wonder if they're like something that really lives out there or if they just made them up. They're cool. Another eyeball. Freaked me out. Another harp. There's harps all through here. Got some snails under a mushroom. I love the medallion or mandalas or whatever, but medallions. Very cool. Oh, look at Oh my gosh, I love them. I love them. And look at the bunny. The bunny. Is that? Well, no, he doesn't have a big enough. Is that a duck-billed platypus? 
I don't know what that is. There's a another bunny and another bunny. Ooh, a falcon. And a swan. And look at these the tails on these squirrels. Very, very cool. Hi, hi cat. Welcome. And these seahorses and some more bats. And look at the iris. That's kind of cool. Oh, there's a peacock. We, we might come back to that peacock. Let's go ahead and we'll mark the page. Just because um, I, I don't want to not get through this book. Because I said we would go through the whole book. And, oh wow. Look at these. They are that big. So again, really cool. You would just go ahead and um, distress around the outside of that. So, oh my gosh. So cool. Ooh, another bat. Lots of bats. Bat page. A gigantic ant. I don't know. I, I, and spiders. And a skeleton with wings. Trippy stuff. Trippy. T oh my gosh. Oh, okay. Well, I think they're really cool, but they, they're, um, I don't, I'm going to have to figure that out. They have, they have cuts and folds in them, you guys. I can't tell what it is. Okay, so you get pieces. A variety of pieces. Oh my gosh, but aren't they gorgeous? Rugs. <laughs> More people. Oh, this is cool. They're all these dancing people. Very fun. So, very, very cool. Oh my gosh, so one Amazon, Amazon price says $16.49, another one post wants $149. Be careful. Look at the butterflies. I should have <laughs> I should have put my Amazon thing down there. I need to start doing that. If I get a chance to put it down there, I'll put it down there tomorrow if you don't go buy it today. But it, it sounds, you know, you might want to because people see this and they might go out there and just grab it up. Look at the little wings <gasps> look at the shoes shoes that's cool kangaroos such a wide variety of things wide variety of things oh look at yeah I haven't um, used my affiliate thingy in a long time so I'm gonna have I'm gonna have to look it up and to set it up. It's not like I can just go do it real quick. I used to um, sell shapewear and I had found some of the the things that we use to um, like the dressing room and stuff like that. I had found them and so I had those um, a long time ago. A clown. Oh my gosh, cat. Okay, I, I'm sorry, you guys. I, I forgot to tell you all again. We are looking at the Antiquarian sticker book. I picked this up at Target today. The cover price is $24.99. And, and then Canada is $33.99. And I got it at Target. In Target, you get 30% off when you buy a book or magazines there. So it was $17 something. And then I used my red card, so it was 5% off. And then there was a special this week on Cartwheel or Target Circle or whatever it is. If you use your red card, got an extra 5%. So I actually got 10% off. So, um, yeah, so I got it for 15 something is what it says on my, um, my return price. Oh, look at these, you guys. Those match the Tim Holtz flowers 
So these need to go on to, um, into my journal. Oh my God, look at this dragonfly thing. <gasps> no, it's two dragonflies on a cat tail that looks, makes it look like another dragonfly. That is cool. That is very cool. And more bugs. Lots of bugs. Lots of coral. Oh my gosh, you guys. A peacock. Peacock. And this collar. That would be, that would go really well in my other peacock journal. This will probably go, I don't know if I'll go in this one or the next. Yeah, it'll probably go in this one. Okay, a whole bunch of that gargoyle kind of stuff. Crab. That totally makes me think of my dad. <laughs> yeah. Sasquatch! <laughs> or one of those white monkey things. Oh my gosh, look at that. There's a person inside that fish. There's just such random, random stuff. Look at these. Puffer fish. <laughs> so we were, we were talking about if you went to Dollar Tree and you bought a set of a page okay we already used that sticker but you bought a page of sticker so it would cost you a dollar and so you get to about here in the book and you've already spent as much as you would spend at Dollar Tree and you'd have this whole book so um so we'll just put that in there again Oh, we've already been on that page, but I really like that one. Look at that. Look at this. Oh. Very cool. Okay, so this is where we were. Hi, Carrie. Welcome. And here we have some birds. An owl and a crow or a raven. Some other birds. That's kind of a cool looking bird. It might be a good bird to put with the the peacock and friends. So we are looking at the antiquarian sticker book. And it is amazing. We have found out that I got mine today at Target. And Vonda found it on Amazon. But you want to be careful on Amazon because they also found it for $149. So, um, and Terry found it to be, oh, look at this, to be able to um, get it in the UK uh, pre-order. So these are like what I have in some of my kits. Oh, cool. Look at this. Just some random geometric shapes. And then we have alphabet pages. Ah, uh, D for deer. Aw, oh, deer. C for cat. I don't know what that is for. His nose is growing. <laughs> That's cool with the vines on it. Huh. Do we have a, one of those silly guys on all of them? Nope. There's a guy wearing an A. I like the tree. E F. Humpty Dumpty, but it's not really Humpty Dumpty, but H. J. That's kind of cool with the... Oh, look at... I, 
I, I see some that I would probably never use, but you know what I would do? I would probably go ahead and make a journal of the journal I would never use. <laughs> and somebody out there would probably absolutely love it. Very, just really cool. I like the... All the different fonts. I think this is really, really cool. We're getting close to the end of the Antiquarian. There we go. Sticker book. It has over a thousand images. First edition, 2020, printed in Malaysia. So that is the book, and I love it. You guys, I think there is more than enough images in here that I will use. Um... Oh, I'm making lots of new digitals. I I won't. I don't use. I don't use other people's stuff, though. I I have all my own um, images. So, uh, but yeah, I have several new digitals coming out. Several that are partially in the works. I just took some time off um, from the parties. So. But, I mean, these fairies are going to look amazing with the fairy kit that I have coming out. Because it's that, this time it's not the bright colors, it's more this, like those colors. Um, so I think that's going to be awesome. And, I mean, there's so many fish in here. And, and just random, random awesome. Look, at there's a lemon. I only saw one lemon in here. Some sunflowers. These are gorgeous. So all of my digital kits are on sale right now through St. Patrick's Day for 50% off. So um, today being Friday the 13th. Um, so it's holiday to holiday. We're celebrating Friday the 13th through... Um, St. Patrick's Day with a 50% off all you have to go remove all the spiders I'd have to remove the eyeballs that's so cute so so anyway so that is our book I have gone through the entire book so that you can go ahead and check it out and let me know what was your favorite? Um, I will put a, a post in the group. That's just a, a post where people know that we, I did, there you go, there's Halloween. Um, the post of, that this video is up. And um, so if you comment below what your, was your, maybe your favorite sticker or your favorite page, and so this is dry and so we'll let you check it out so this is one of the stickers that was in the the book and then i went ahead and i distressed around the outside right while it was in the book and here is another image that was another image from the book so look at there i've already used two images Woohoo! so Trade eyeballs. <laughs> yeah, I don't like spiders that much either. They probably did, Vonda. Um, I, I just want you all to know that when anything that you see in my, my digital kits, I literally own the images. I have a stack right here from, oh, this is from the Beautiful Birds. So I literally own all of my my stuff. Everything that I use, I own. 
I don't I don't want to take the chance that somebody had a bad bad day and bad day and put something in. <laughs> so hi Joyce. So there you go. Um oh, the page with the hedgehog. So lots and lots of pretty things in here. And a couple more penguins in, or penguins. See? See, I did you guys wait till you see the mini challenge in the challenge video. I kept saying penguin all through it. So just a little note that if you um if you want when you watch that video later today, um I explain the challenge and then I explain it again better towards the end of the video. So if you don't want to watch me um, making the stuff, then make sure that you know you watch that the beginning and watch the end and that has um, the information for the challenge. And so I will go and that should be up sometime later this afternoon. Say hi to Lucy. Tom just got home, so she's coming to tell me that, hey, Tom's home. We get to eat now. <laughs> oh, my gosh. What am I going to do when this cat goes home, you guys? What am I going to do when she goes home? I don't know. <laughs> so say hi. Say hi to everybody, Lucy. Say hi. Yep. Yep, she's pretty awesome. She's a scaredy cat, though. She's afraid of every little sound, every little thing. Barbara liked a fairy. Oh my gosh, I love that. There's some beautiful things in there. And I think that even with some of the ones that I would maybe not use, you know, I could probably go ahead and cut them up and put them in. To, you know, I could make something out of them. And, um, yeah. The flowers, the sunflowers, and the fairies. Yeah. So, well, like I said, this is my Easter gift to myself. I'm going to be putting it in my Easter basket. And there's the there's where the peacock was. So, and if you didn't see, in between each page of stickers, you have these pages also. So, um, we'll have to check that out, what happens when you use, you know, We'll have to see how the paper, because this will be an easy page for me to use up. So, and I saw, oh my gosh, I, I think my favorite image is that girl, that the girl in the blue dress. Her, but she reminds me of something my mom would have painted. That's probably why I like her so much. We've got a fairy on a turkey over here, or a chicken. <laughs> this is a funny page right here. Oh, another unicorn. I think I'll, I'm going to go, I'll, I'll probably sit on the couch and look at this tonight. Because um, I went through the, the, the third stack of magazines from my mom's house. So maybe I'll, I picked this up at, um, I picked it up at Target. And, of course, at Target, you get 30% off. And then I had my red card, so I got 5% off. And then Cartwheel or Target Circle or whatever it is, had an, this week has an additional 5% off. So I, got a, so I got another 10% off. The original price on this is $24.99 for U.S. Canada, $33.99. Now, Vonda found it on Amazon. For sixteen sixty nine, so if maybe if you don't have a Target nearby, and it was oh gosh, I was gonna remember where it was in the books. It was in the books. Um, I think it was actually in the children's, like at the end of the children's section. So, yeah, so I got it at um, Target. But, but Vonda found it on Amazon, and Terry also found it on Amazon and being able to get it in the UK. So, um, so check that out. 
it's pretty exciting I think it's very very worth very worth it I think that especially if you get all those discounts and it had I think it has four or five four peacocks in it so we we made this we made started this with one of them and we have this one and then there's one that looks like the wrought iron gate and then there's I think there was one other one so and there's birds and there's snakes and there's flowers and there's bugs and mandalas and people and shoes I love shoes <laughs> So, so there you go. So my husband is home. It is Friday and we are going to go and have a weekend. So stay tuned. Uh, make sure, please go watch another video after you finish watching this because then YouTube knows that I get people to stay on their platform and watch things. Um, and that really helps out my challenge. Cha challenge. My channel don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you think about it come back and comment on the video later um, all of those little things do help so um, I hope if this is something that you want I hope that it isn't like toilet paper and you can't find it find something to celebrate every day don't forget to subscribe have an amazing day Mwah! have a great weekend happy Friday the 13th oh Speaking of Friday the 13th, I will be putting a, a one sheet into the group this weekend to celebrate Friday the 13th. So um, I need to make my note. Not on that paper. You know, this sucks, you guys, because no scratch paper is really scratch paper anymore unless I dig it out of the trash. <laughs> okay, Friday 13th. And yesterday was... Um, 42, something about 42. And I did not get that one done either. I slept. <laughs> Have a great weekend, everybody. Oh, sorry, Sarah. Thank you, guys. Do, if you didn't, if you came in on the end, like I said, we went through this entire book and showed you what you're going to be able to get in that. I think it's going to make a great... Um, altered book after we, you know, because taking out the pages and then using these pages that are in here. Oh my gosh, I just, I can see an amazing, amazing journal. Or using these pages because you see this, it is string bound. Okay, so these pages, well, just a second. Sorry to all those that already left. So you can um, dissect the book like this. Well, you could. If, if your knife was stronger than mine. Okay. So, um, you know, I do this all the time in books because I want the pages to be together intact. Well, anyway taking those out and then you're able to pull out this page right here and you'd have a side-by-side -side page for a journal okay so say you you used all the stickers or if you were putting it in this into like a flow journal for a get a guest a guest a gift then um so you have side-by-side -side pages i i just like I do with the composition book when I take the composition book apart and it gives me a side by page, side by side page, you're going to be able to do that with this book. And then on top of it, you have a great book to be making a cover. This book, this book is just going to keep on giving and giving, giving and giving. So I hope I gave you, <laughs> and I'm not making a penny on this book, you guys, <laughs> but I, I hope you go out and if you can and it's something that you wanted that you're able to find it and have it in your collection and I think we'll go ahead and start a series 
where I will be making embellishments out of the antiqu antiquarian sticker book. Maybe we'll do the ugly. You know, the things that are things that maybe Bonnie can tell, you know, tell me of a couple that she wouldn't use or something. I don't know. And um, we'll figure something out. So there you go. Continue to find something to celebrate every day. Have a great day. Bye. Bye-bye. Thank you for being here. Bye.